Welcome to another part of Dave the Diver. In this one, I'll be taking on mermaid zombies and some giant bosses, all while relaxing, diving, catching fish, and serving up some sushi. Hi, I'm Mad Morph, and if you're new here, hit that like and subscribe for more cozy indie gaming playthroughs. For those who have been waiting a while for this next part, I apologize. Thank you so much for all the comments on the last one. That's really what encouraged me to make sure I came back to this and do another video for you. So please do enjoy it and we'll see where we go from here with it. Hopefully gonna finish it. I think I'm quite close to the end. So enjoy this nice long part of Dave the Diver just for you, for your likes and comments on the last one. And leave me some more if you wanna see more of it. Enjoy the video. <gasps> A giant one. I was not expecting that. Just, did I see a huge Cleo? I was not expecting that. What, is that gonna appear when I get the last one? All done. Oh my. Okay. Unexpected uh, fish napping. Oh, what is this place? Oh, it's such a big Cleone. Cleon Queen. She's a Cleon Queen. Oh, I probably don't want to get away without a fight. Let's defeat it. A boss. Oh, and I only have a hush gun. Okay, well, let's see what's in here. Something new. Oh, dear. That a little sick up. Threw up. Stings. Just get this air first. What's this? Nothing. Slice off a piece. A tentacle. Ah, now there's something there. Okay. Looks like it's a picture of the girl. A photo of Mackie. What? Did her dad turn into that thing or did it eat her and ate the picture at the same time? Here, a Cleone like you asked. It's so beautiful. Thank you, Dave. And I found this. Huh? Is this a photo of me? There was a huge Cleo. I found this in its home. There's a button on the back. I mean, there's a button on the back. I'll try pressing it. Wow. Maggie. It's your father. If you're watching this, then... I've probably failed my expedition. I couldn't really take care of you with my busy schedule. My greed for more work has turned me into an irresponsible father. You haven't been able to make many friends because we kept moving around because of my work. Even so, I want you to forgive me for being a terrible father and live a confident life. Your dream of becoming a chef, I hope it comes true. I'll keep watching you from afar, so don't ever lose your smile. Mm. Daddy. Come work here, Mackie. It seems to have cut off. Oh, 
Oh, don't be too upset. Seems your father really loved you. Please let me work here. What? So suddenly? Yes, my father wouldn't like to see me so lethargic and sad. I want to show him that I'm doing fine. You've showed concern for me. I'd like to help you. Bancho, what do you think? What a spirited child. I like her. You can start working here today, but you won't get any special treatment. Okay, I'll work hard to learn and become an amazing chef. Ah, cool. Awesome. Okay, so we just need to get the rice. Oh, the rice already grown. There's an odd energy in this region. Come over to farm. Come get your rice, eh? Oh, the rice is grown. Let's try harvesting it. Put up the weeds. That's a good lad. Come on, you manatee. Get to work. You got the hang of harvesting now, right? Yeah. Can I plant more rice immediately? The land needs some time to recover, you know. You just need to wait half a day. In any case, rice this quality should satisfy you that director guy. Okay. Good job. Oh. Hey, have you read the email you just got? It says there'll be a tuna party. Oh. Right, and tuna is Sushi's best friend. Oh. I haven't seen tuna in the blue hole for a while. It's the beginning of tuna season now. <laughs> we'll be able to make a fortune. Okay. Isn't it difficult to catch tuna? That's why investment's needed. I'll bring a tool. Ah, so the next event is a tuna party. Farming reports available. Right, let's, um... What are we doing? Let us... Continue to see people. Up there and move the story forward. See people trust. I'm gonna make you trust me. Trust in me. Oh no. What is it, Mima? I need to serve customers, but I'm missing an ingredient. Venture to the depths. Oh, you're helping. Tube coral. Find it near whale bones. Okay. I'm gonna have to do to get your trust. Oh yeah, the seahorses. Let's get those so we can do seahorse races. I'm gonna try and spot them. There's one. Two more. My goodness, human, this is the one. Thanks to you, we'll be able to have a wedding. Nice. A uh, human, or rather, Dave, was it? If you participated, you could become better acquainted with the villagers. A wedding invite? Let's do it. Here we are, Dave. Well, it feels different to a human wedding. Is that so? You can stay in the back. It'll begin soon. I always cry at weddings. Oh. Another earthquake. K King Long's arm. There's no time to waste, guys. This is terrible. It's actually a very old statue. We don't have the tools to patch it up. This is not good. Calm down. Maybe Cobra will have something. I'll see if there's anything we can use on the surface. 
repair your statues now. Gosh, I'm doing everything around here, aren't I? So I thought maybe they'd be hiding in the buildings, and I was right. Look, there's the last one. And the other one was just in the seed shop. After I roamed around for a little bit, trying to find them out in the wild, they were inside. But of course they were. Which means we can do horse races now. Let's go back to the casino. quite sure how many of these I have to do to earn the trust of the people, but there's been a lot of missions already. And I'm wondering if it's all of them in every mission you have, or if it's just a certain amount, like a certain quest line. Oh wow, he brought back all the seahorses. They were quite difficult to find. They were difficult. I'll give you a seahorse as thanks. Well, where can I get one? Go speak to Yami. <clears throat> Hope to see you around. Yami? Oh my, you're the human. I'm Yami, in charge of the seahorse race course. I heard you caught all the seahorses that ran off. Thank you. I heard from Lin Chen already. We'll give you a nice strong seahorse as a gift for your efforts. Okay. So now I have a seahorse. Couldn't they also race here? Of course, bring them to me. I'll register them for races. Since you're here, why don't you try registering your seahorse? <clears throat> register. Hire. Select the race. Select the course and begin a race. Okay. It's like a whole horse racing minigame. Once seahorses race, they need to rest to pick up a stamina. Okay. Ready. Here to increase the seahorse speed. If gauge goes past green, you slow down. Different grades and types of races. Okay. Cheering. seems fair when I was maxed out. A stone adhesive for use underwater. Let's see. Oh good, it was in the corner. This should do. So when I go back I can attach the arm. Let's hunt tuna! Steel net sensor trap. Okay. Oh, we got a drone now? It took me quite some time to replace the one you broke last time. It wasn't my fault. It broke when I activated it. I made a big investment for moments like this. This is what a businessman does. Cool. Man, there is so much to this game, isn't there? Let's have a look at what this is. Because I know when I sleep the big fish, it asks for the drone. Right, I'm here. Cat food. You gonna tell me what to do? <gasps> tuna. I like tuna. Do you like tuna? I see tuna. The fish is big but fast. I'd love to catch him. Use a tool. You out. A 
I love a tuna sandwich. Baby. Wait, so I've got one call in per... That looks so cool. Oh, it can get this big tuna without a problem. I'm impressed. It's very powerful. If you ever catch a big fish, use the drone. Need one of these drones to keep the grade of your catch. Fish with wounds can't have high grade. Right. Oh, I wanted to read that. I didn't even... It was as I hit to skip the thing. Uh... Alright, let's get some tuna. Even though these ones will have wounds. I wonder how much they'll take. Eh. Probably too much. Keep getting this bottom one, but... Ah. What a load of rubbish. Okay, well, we need tube coral for the old lady, the mer. Old lady mer herself. seen you since the first session. What is it now? Do you need me to follow you? The pink dolphin I met before. What if it gets caught by poachers again? If we raise awareness about it, can we make it harder to poach? I should take a picture and get it published. Oh. Blowing the bubble. Heart shaped water drop. Okay, take it back. Take it again. You're gonna do a heart, are you? Cute. I mean, barely got it, but the game thinks we did. How exciting. That was bloody rubbish. Some more O2. Let's go get that tube coral. Do you know what? Let's get some more parrot head because we know that that is really high level now. You're listening to three hours of cutting up a fish ASMR. Sushi preparation ASMR channel. Upgrade. 
upgrade, a bit of ammo. Let's keep going down. If I were a tube coral, where would I be? Now she said the depths, so I think I have to go where it's actually dark. Not another net gun looking away from me. Cool, so my weapon's pretty good right now. Oh, your baba. Look out. I'm wondering if I can get to the depths through the limestone cave. Can't remember. Does it have a bottom? Looks like we can. No? How are you alive? Two level three shotgun blasts. Die, fish. Please. Oh, what? What's that? What's that? How do I do that? What? Hit the green every time? Guys ever do that uh, brain training? Green, blue, green, blue, red. And you have to like say the color that it says and not the color that it is, or the color that it is and not the color that it says. It's very confusing. But you just end up sitting there staring at your DS, going blue, green, red. I mean orange, uh, red, green, pink. oxygen first. Then take that. There you go. Ow. My love, where is your chambered thingies? She said the depths, I'm pretty sure. Go deeper than this, even. Ow. Being pursued by a fish. They're being hunted. Surprise! Ah, near whale bones. Hang on. Yes. Oh. Now I remember. And could the Mega Mouth have the ball? The children's ball? They said get up. It's in a Mega Mouth. Wait, are you a Mega Mouth? Yes, you are. Ow. I 
think it likes it. Okay. Good. Let's get that other tube. Need three, I think. And the. Oh right, I forgot. I needed that coral porridge for the sea person. Ah, okay, that was not a tube. And that's the tube coral. Beautiful. What if we drop a rock on a crab? Which is a terrible thing to say if you're not playing a game about making sushi, let's be honest. But I'm trying to discover how to get this crab. <laughs> and that would be how. Okay. Oh no, I just feel sad. Well, myself. Up we go. Even chilling in one like a cage like that and going down, I would freak. Not a chance. Man, I had pizza yesterday as like an end of week treat, and I am still so full today. You ever just have so much pizza? Oh, you brought a picture of something? Can I see? A oh, pink dolphin? He's so adorable, I'd like to take it home. I'm kidding. Great, let's name the dolphin Pinky and get people to notice. Then poachers won't be able to catch it so easily. See, I'm so basic with naming that I called it literally what the game calls it. What this guy in the game calls it. <laughs> I'll put your picture to good use. <laughs> it's sushi time, baby. we got to serve up a meal. Mm -hmm. For a VIP. Ah, oh. oh, phew, this place is rather hot. Eh? Is the food ready? Be honest, I won't chide you if it isn't. <laughs> Here you are. Okay. Mm, it looks like an explosive dish. It looks nice. Will the taste justify its fanciness? <laughs> Try it. <laughs> Give it to a venture. to me, yes. Such powerful inspirations filling my soul. I haven't felt this way in a while. This rice, it's not easy to find such rice in this part. How did you? I had some help from a friend. You continue making your masterful movies that pluck at the heartstrings. You're welcome to eat here whenever you like. You're quite the man. I like your style. Perhaps my next movie should be about a sushi bar. It should feature a man with a missile launcher on one hand. What kind of story is that? In any case, I think I'm all set. This is a robot samurai poster with my autograph. Have it as a gift. My gosh. Robot samurai. You can look forward to next movie. You can probably hang that up in here, I would think. Increase your rating now in the Cookster app. Let's do that too. Here they are. Cookster rating. Oh. Gold. New recipes. New unlocks. Okay, what do you have to do next? Get followers, get best tasting, and research some recipes. Alright. 
Ah, look. Mackie is a hundred in the kitchen. Perfect. Now... I feel like... Can I assign... Like, the guy we have in the kitchen is actually not very good at cooking. You know? Who's for hire? He has 93 appeal. Okay, we might have to let you go. And hire... Can I not move you up? Dispatch, dismiss. I guess I would remove and then put you in. Like, now I have two amazing chefs. Although, <laughs> Mackie has one appeal. I don't know what appeal does, but... If I train you, you get another 45 cooking skill. And who's for hire right now? That guy's only got 45 cooking, but loads of appeal. Probably the best server. How are you at serving? Not great. Let's get. Hmm. Mm, I sort of want to get the guy with the high appeal to counteract Mackie's low appeal bring our average up, just in case it does matter. I reckon. And put you in here. And we can always train you. It looks like your cooking skill goes up so much more than serving. But the other cooks are just better, dude. Like, you become an ingredient prep expert. 5% chance of increasing the number of plates, but... Ugh, I wanted a server, not a cook. So that was a bit of a waste of money. Train the staff. There you go. I mean, he has a 10% increase. He's great. Now, What's Mackie's upgrade? Cooking plus... Cooking ability increased 240? I mean, my gosh. Definitely wasted money on that other guy. What was that? 300? I want the best cooks. Mackie seems to have prepared something. Prepared what? How do I see what you're thinking about? Learn the recipe. Okay. Well, I'll leave you serving for now. Sorry, that took far too long. Right, menu. We'll serve up spider crab. Gonna save the tuna. My level five nautiluses. Level three mega mouth shark sushi. The level seven parrot head. Yes. Tasty. And I guess I'll serve the seahorses for some extra flavor, some taste. Good luck, everyone. Have a good service. Let's go. Chop, chop. kitchen. How much wasabi went already? For 
you. For you. Okay, clean up. Oh no. They're waiting. Don't keep them waiting. How do I get better at pouring a beer? Oh my god, three beers. Help me. Good. Yes, my first perfect beer. staff we all just got here. Money. Paid for all of the money we just spent. Uh, so the picture you took was well received? Great to hear that. I hear my superiors want to assign me another task. If I bring them a picture as nice as the previous ones, I have an offer. Join me and take a picture that will stand the test of time. What are you planning to take a picture of? Manta rays. Ah, of course. They're one of the largest of their kind. I'm planning to take a picture of them. What do you think? I'm sold. But, but, they're nocturnal. We need to move at night. We need some lure. Okay. So many side missions. Slightly overwhelming. Like, I just want to dive and fish at this point. Make a phone call to Ellie. Let me fish. Do you know what manta rays feed on? Hmm. I know what manta rays eat. Really? Plankton at night. Drop something that lures glowing plankton. Okay. Thanks. Let's see about upgrading gear. Carry weight. Um, wait for now. Let's do our gun. Okay. Let's go back to the sea people. Because I have a bunch of stuff. To turn in. <gasps> I didn't get Bancho to make the porridge. Damn it. Thought it would do it automatically. Oh my, yes, this is it. Thank you. I'd like to hear about you humans. Drop by and chat. Credit. By the way, I realized how dumb I was earlier, being like, I don't know how much I need. It's literally there. I have 95 of 100. <laughs> so if I had the porridge... It would have been perfect. It would be done. Maybe I do, though. Maybe I do have it automatically. Let's find out. Then we can move the Mer story forward. Oh, yes, I can fix the statue. I forgot I had this. Oh, power. Power. Just don't worry about the beginning bit, it's fine. It'll hold, you know? It looks completely undamaged. Thank you, Dave. We're good. Let's go up. Let's see the boss man.
Tenjin. Tenzin. It seems the villagers seem to trust you quite a lot. I'd first like to thank you for everything you've done for our village. Everyone's friendlier than I thought. I don't trust you fully just yet, but we could use all the help we could get right now. Let me explain to you about the village. Did you see that tree? Yeah, huge, covered in ice. We call it the Divine Tree. We use the fruit of this tree as an energy source. The tree has its roots far below the bottom, using the geothermal heat to create energy. The fruits are created from this energy, and there's a giant glacier under this tree. That is under our village. A glacier on the sea bottom? Never heard of such a thing. As of late, the heat coming from deep in the earth has grown hotter, melting the ice slowly. As the temperature of the tree increases more, more and more villagers are falling ill. We keep praying to King Long, but we know things aren't as simple as that. We need to check on the glacier below the surface. We've relied on our ag only agriculture for so long. We don't have equipment or technology to explore down there. That's why I told you we need the human's help. It is our only option, my daughter. In any case, I know it's a difficult task. Will you check out the glacial area below the village? Sounds dangerous, but alright. Man, we're going deep, deep. And in, there have been more tremors on the surface as well. This all might be connected. Where is the key? Tenzin, when we sealed the glacial passage, we put the key inside the abandoned cave, remember? Oh dear, you're right. Human, go get the key. Suam will take you there. Haha, <laughs> nothing's happened there for the last century. No one's ventured in there for a hundred years. Anyways, we need to find out what's going on in the Glacier Zone. It's getting late. Come back tomorrow when the sun is up. It never ends with you people, does it? What do you mean, you people? Uh, I mean... My... People, I guess. Uh. I knew you were just like the other humans. But it is morning, so we should be able to go up now, right? There's a mission over here. Who's it with? The seed guy. Seed shop? Where is the book? Which book? Ah, human, good to see you. There's a book that contains the famous words of King Long. Can't find it. Wanted to read it in the evening while resting. Oro, from where? Nyamo's temple, of course. Borrow another book from the temple for me while I look around. Why? Sending me all over the place. Thought I was done helping you guys. I only helped for a reward. Now that's done, I'm out of here. Stormy night number two, find the vortex. I think that's worth pursuing. God, I love the sound of rain and storms. You're listening to Down to Sleep, a bedtime story with rain sounds. That's my podcast and my second YouTube channel, which you can hear at Down to Sleep and at Down to Sleep Extra. On YouTube and everywhere you get podcasts. Wink. Let me read you a bedtime story. To the vortex. And also, remember how to play. Because it's been a little minute. So many games came out. I got so much work that came in. And I neglected my sweet, sweet Dave. But I'm playing it again. And honestly, a big reason to be continuing with this, A, I'm enjoying it. B, you guys have left so many comments saying, you know, I really enjoy how you play this. Can you play some more? And genuinely that stuff, it shouldn't affect me as much as it does, right? I should just do what I want to do, blah, blah, blah. But when I know it's making people happy, it does make me want to play it <laughs> more, you know? I think that's natural. any ammo if we're about to go in a vortex which is very loud let's go down here sounds like it's coming from down here yeah 
Let's see. Wait, hang on. What's this? A fragment. Okay, now I'll go in. You know, when you get a video that people really respond well to and say, <clears throat> Oh, I really enjoyed this. Please play more. It's like, okay, I will. <laughs> I ended up in a strange place, space again. Mm. Well, this place looks uninhabited. Wouldn't be so sure. Okay, so there's a level 3 rifle there. Take that for now. What do we got? A boxing lobster. Oh, a mantis shrimp. <clears throat> I knew that. A crawfish wearing a pair of boxing gloves. I think I know what it is. It must be a mantis shrimp. Its size is unreal. It could crush me with one hit. It'd be nice if I could find something tough to block that thing's punches. Something to block its punches. What about this? I get pushed back into spikes. Well, I still got hit. I'm not sure. Oh dear. That's not <laughs> changed your weapon, Dave. Goodness me. Maybe it's on the other side of it. Okay. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Please tell me there's some oxygen on this side. There isn't. Okay, great. Suddenly this boss is insane. What the heck? What was that? Can I pick this up with the glove, maybe? Like, what am I supposed to do there? Ugh. Not really working. Not really working, is it? this? Ring ding ding. Let me get some. Feels like I'm going to need to switch to this actually. As you were uh, not exposed there. Dodge, parry, weave. sense now. Before I was like, oh, this is just going to be an insanely hard boss. Swim, 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 and shoot. Nope, not close enough. And shoot. Shoot. Shoot again. And again. And again. Now run. Get the health. Get the health. Get the... It's going to absolutely smashed into pieces. Think you're about to get yourself. Got the ammo. Yeah, out of it. Go away, dude. Tough one. That 
Must be something worth picking up. Cut him up. I guess that should be enough. Boing. Out we go. Five kelp. Something new. Oh, lionfish, lionfish. This is a mantis shrimp boss card. I haven't seen it even at the gym. Oh, I mean the gym I work out at. Look, transfer this card using share. I got it. This guy just takes my cards. Alright, sushi time. Chapter 3. A request from the... VIP, Sammy the Rap Star. Huh. Uh, didn't the manager say he saw someone who looked like Otto around here? Yeah. Hey, chef, may I ask you something? Perfect. Welcome to Pancho Sushi. Yeah. Hey, you guys sell vegetable sushi here by any chance? Mm. Vegetable sushi? <laughs> we don't have that on the menu. Noramaki sushi is the closest thing to that, though. <laughs> Not Norimaki sushi, I want sushi made with fresh veggies. Yeah. It's okay, I'll get going. Have a good one. Oh, wait. The music. It's Hot Pepper Tuna. The title song for my first album. This kind of music intrigues me. You must be MC Sammy, I presume. Yeah, you recognize me. I'm pleased to see one of my fans here. Can you make me some vegetable sushi? We do have some vegetables, but vegetable sushi is not simple. Give me three days. Uh, nice, yo. I'll come back in three days then. This is kind of a lot. Hapepetuna. Hapepetuna tuna. Nope. What is your plan? I don't know this more about vegetables than I do. I was going to ask him. That makes sense. I'll give him a call. Otto. Alright, Mr. Frodo. Hello, Dave. What's up? One of our customers asked us to make some vegetable sushi. We need to secure the ingredients. Uh, vegetable sushi? That's one of my favourites. <laughs> that customer knows what's what. Give me some time. I'll call you tomorrow morning. Okay. I'll become a great cook and make my father proud. She's in the kitchen now. Let's do it, guys. Let's just open up. Wait, menu. I gotta remember how to play. <laughs> Got a little excited. <laughs> um, let's see. Level three, the trebly. Um, hang on. Remaining food will be discarded. Wait, I wanted to put more on though. There you go. And those. I have a lot of these, so we may as well enhance that. Skip that. Um, enhance again. The tiger shrimp. Actually, no. Just serve those now, because I don't pick those up very much. A steamed wolf eel. Who's that for? Quite the recipe there. Um, let's serve some seasoned kajime. Is that seaweed? Like that you get at a sushi place? Because I had that the other day and it's actually really nice. And um, I'm going to serve this curry. 
Nearly spilled my drink. Oh my god, I'm so clumsy sometimes. Okay, we'll go from here. I haven't played in like a week. I've got to remember, yeah. It's going to be interesting. Luckily, I've got some staff to have my back. Let's see if anyone needs a drink at this end. No? Oh, I'm all the right amount. See if I've still got it. Like riding a bike. Oh, maybe not. Oh, right up the end. Uh, I'm coming, miss. Wait. Oh, I'll refill the wasabi. Can never be enough wasabi. still quite a bit left on the menu, isn't there? I forgot again, I used up some of the night. I didn't need to add that much stuff to the menu. That's a shame. I wasted quite a bit of food there. That felt like a quick one. Oh well, I can always get more. Oh, I should call it a day. It's a long road, becoming a great master. <gasps> it's this guy. What's this cutscene? I, I don't understand people who leave food boxes around. I couldn't. Like, my place is messy sometimes, but not food boxes. Those pillows are actually pretty comfy. I like to hug a pillow sometimes. A dream come true. Is this going to be a mini game? A live stage begins in Duff's dream. When the high button reaches the cursor, press the buttons, move your hand up and down and hit the green note. When an orange note appears, shake left and right. Alright. Rhythm game. Hi, 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 hi. Oh my god. Look at him. Oh, I have to hit him together. Oh, just to, okay. Just hold up. Reminds me of um, Yakuza karaoke. One of my favorite things ever. Sun, sun. to enjoy any of that anime going on up there because I had to focus on down here. That's, I guess that's the distraction. No waifus for me. Excellent. Did you play enough? I think we did.
new mobile game called Leah's Run, now available. Play the game from your phone game factory. Wednesday. Chapter four? That was the end of, whoa, that was the end of chapter three? Mm -hmm. By the way, mm -hmm. Tenzin asked me to bring him the Glacier Passage mm -hmm. Key. I must return to the Elder's Place in the Sea People Village. What? Get yourself some sleep, Dave. Mm -hmm. I guess. Mm -hmm. Yesterday you said you needed ingredients for vegetable sushi. Mm -hmm. Yeah, some customers were looking for that. I think sushi tastes best when made from fish. <laughs> Come on over to farm first. I got something to show you. Mm -hmm. There's new space. <laughs> That's right. Just growing rice would be boring now, wouldn't it? Um, I tinkered around yesterday and made a garden next to it. Mm. A garden? Um, you betcha. A place where you can grow vegetables and fruits. <laughs> Not just for vegetable sushi, mind. All sorts of stuff for dishes. <laughs> Sounds great. Um, Since you'll have to manage the farm yourself, I'll give you an explanation. Oh. First of all, I'll give you some tools and seeds you need to farm with. Take them. It's a farming mini game. Now try planting eggplant and carrot. There are three bundles in each. Fill one row with two packs. Select the seed. Plant the seeds. First we sow the seed. Then we grow the seed. After planting, don't forget to use watering can. You get that. Fill with water. This is cute. And water the soil. Um, well, you learn quick. Hmm. When you get back from the crops, it's equal to the work you put um, in. Stop by often and pull weeds um, and water plants. Status of crops can be checked in a farm now. Mm -hmm. You can now use the vegetable farm. Farming. All these weeds then save my little nutrition. Let's go to the boat. I like the music in that area. It's fun. Well, let's go down since he seemed to want to go see the sea people. I wonder how many chapters there are actually. Will I finish this game is the real question. You know what's funny is my <laughs> my back was hurting yesterday and I had no idea why. I hadn't done anything for my back to hurt. I hadn't really lifted anything. I've been working a lot through the day, but I'm usually like sat working. Um, and I was so busy I didn't take my walk, so maybe it was like my back like wasn't stretched out or whatever. And I opened my phone and my phone is one of these ones that has like adverts on its left swipe of news stories. And the headline was like, the exact age that people start to notice aches and pains, and it's like, I, phones are so psychic sometimes. I haven't even spoken out loud to anyone or searched anything. N there's no reason for my phone to know that my back was hurting, and I'm th I was thinking yesterday, like, why is my back hurting for no reason? And I've been quite lucky with back pain, um, especially with what I do, that I don't have it a lot. And I was like, oh, is this the start of it? You know, is this? Is my back gonna go now? Am I at that age? And, um, how funny. I don't, phones do that all the time, don't they? Of, um, you sort of, you go on TikTok and you're like, I was just thinking about this thing. It's like they're secretly connected to our brains. Uh, deliver Nautiluses. So these are like side quest requests. Now, if I go up to the main temple, that was up here, wasn't it? Let's see what chapter four is all about. We want to borrow a book from here, so let's do that. Oh no, this is Tension's house. Oh, you have returned, human. The abandoned cave is an old abandoned sea people's storage. The glacier passage key is in the place. Suam will guide you. Oh, I thought you fled, human. Suam, the best warrior of the sea people, will guide you to the place.
Let's go. Here, human, bring me the key. So dreary and dark. Why is this place locked, anyway? Not sure. Heard stories about crazy sea people locked up somewhere. Heard the insane ones attacked the other sea people. That was like a thousand years ago. Sea people only live about 300 years, so don't worry. Are you coming with me? I'm the best warrior of my people. You want me to do such a mundane task? I will stay here and protect the area. It's hidden in one of the deepest areas. Look for a room with a mural. Let me know when you're ready. Are you ready? What's this gonna be? Sea people zombies? It's cold. The key should be deeper inside. I will do my best in an abandoned cave in a vest. Gonna be better than the rest when I find a key. That's the test in a glacial passage underground. Looking for what we found. Yeah. What a cute sea broom. It must have come through that small crack. Zombies! game now. Holy cow. The ancient sea people. They're still alive. It's fortunate they're locked in the cells. I don't know, Dave. They're probably waiting for you. They're gonna have a nibble on you. Did it, did it, did it. Oh. No, no, no. Mural. Mm. Mm. Where's the key? Okay. The picture seems to imply something. Yeah. I'm gonna have to arrange. Cool little puzzle. Looks like that one goes there. This one here. Ah. Ah. It up. Balancing rocks. Little zenny rock formation. Uh. Uh. What? Eh. How's that not right? Why is that? What? Why is that not triggering? Open all the, the gates, I wonder. The device. Oh, that must be the key. I'd better pick it up and leave. At last, playing that artifact hunting adventure game pays off. Movie was not great, though. Oh, how scared would you be? Underwater mer zombies trying to eat you? That's absolutely terrifying. Mm. Another earthquake. Mm. Oh, that's something crumbling. Deliver key. to eat you, Dave. The exit's blocked. Uh, the sea monsters. Oh, I must avoid them. Gadon is the name of the ancient sea people who are mutated for some reason. No guns or knives can kill them. Escape the cave without being spotted. 
Wow. Um. Well, that was silly. Please just start me in here to let me start the day again. He turned around like so quick. Is there another place to hide here? Like, what am I supposed to do there? Maybe when he's going that way. So, yeah, that's so quick that I need to go behind on this way. Okay. Oh, <laughs> zombie nibble eating me and dribbling. Oh, what's this? Oh, I can hide behind the statue. <laughs> it's so cool. Da 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 da. Hello, anyone coming? Spikes. Oh, I don't know if that was worth it just for a silver ball. sometimes. They want to eat me, and not in like a good hugs aren't enough, I need to consume you kind of way. Not in a my love is too strong for you, I need to devour you kind of way. Just in a eat me to eat me way. Awful, the worst way of being eaten. <laughs> Hello, welcome to video. Today I'm ranking the best and worst ways of being eaten. This is a devouring ranking list. S tier. Uh, you just love them so much. I knew someone was not going to wait. this diver boy. Lex Loser over here. Wait, are you robbing graves now? As if destroying the environment was not enough. Uh, that's the sea peoples? Be quiet. Whoever harms the great sea will have to contend with Sea Blue and the Wrath of I, John Watson. Feel my eco friendly Sea Blue Armor RX 93 and its power. You're gonna. Oh. Dude. Oh, you sealed it up. Okay, well, that's not too bad. You're an environmental disaster. You're gonna pay. John Watson. No amount of words can save that thick skulled moron. Me when I reply to comments online. <laughs> and immediately regret it. Like, what am I doing? That suit looks tough. Like, actually trying to have an opinion or comment something. Such a waste of time. The missiles are slowing down. But if I could direct it at him, is there anything that could deflect him? Oh yeah, we playing baseball, baby. Come on. Shoot your missiles at me, boy. Uh huh. I didn't do it. Come on, give me another one. Oh, bop. I need to go higher up. 
I wonder if I should charge it when I hit it. Need some oxygen. Skills here. Maybe my hit. Ah! Even my armor card to gate the firepower of my hyperblaster. Nice trick. Some of this, come on. Ow, okay. You gave me some. Stop it, oh dear. I need that oxygen now. Oxygen now. Her. Yeah. Ah, oh, my eco friendly Sea Blue Armor RX 93 is. Ah, oh, I can't forgive you. Watching you. <laughs> Bye. You're tenacious, wearing high tech diving gear. Should I bring it to Cobra? You may find useful parts out of this. Yeah. Pick it up. Hello, princess. Oh, you actually brought me the key. Suam told me he cleared the area and the key is free to be picked up, but I guess it took you some time. I almost got eaten. Are you telling me you've seen Gadons? Gadons? It's the dark history of the sea people. I have a short version and a long version. Which one? Short. The Gadons are the corrupt sea people of ancient times. That's it. In short, yes. Do you want a longer version? <laughs> okay. I can tell you the story of the Gadons. Hit me with it. About 800 years ago, the Gadons were at the pinnacle of their civilization. Our ancestors had many devices far more technologically advanced than the younger humans in the old days. These advanced technologies allowed them to live in peace and prosperity. It was all possible due to the divine tree fruits. These fruits provided the perfect balance of temperature and energy, and they lasted so long. The fruits that could only grow in the deep sea were like a blessing to our ancestors, however. There are always those who are blinded by greed. Dash, one of the senior technicians, wanted to apply the powers of the fruits beyond mundane purposes. He processed the fruits secretly and used them to modify the anatomy of the sea people. He modified the bodies? Yes. It all went well in the beginning. Modified individuals exhibited strength far exceeding that of ordinary sea people. But Dash was not satisfied with modifying the fruits and wanted to go further. He wanted to extract energy directly from the divine tree. He began to infuse the extracted energy into an ancient creature called Yawi. I don't understand everything, but it sounds dangerous. Did King Long know about that? At the time, King Long was busy with the task of building the control room, ensuring a steady supply of resources from the tree. He was puzzled at the increased performance of the workers, but he had no clue. One day... The bodies of those infused with the energy of the tree began to exhibit weird changes. Their body turned pale, their limbs twisted. They became so violent they began to attack other sea people. They are the monsters I encountered. 
Fortunately for us, the mutated ones hate light. They don't come near the village. King Long himself went into the control room, captured the Godons, and locked them up. In the course of suppressing them, King Long suffered fatal wounds and died. But it happened 800 years ago. I didn't know they were still alive. That means, maybe, some of them may be still roaming the Glacier Passage. You're expecting me to go there? I beg you, the sea people have been weakened by our ranching lifestyle. You are the only one we know. Who can help us find the cause of the earthquake? Fine. Thank you, human brother. And take this. Sea people necklace. Wear this and the tube worms will retreat. You know those strange worms that look like sticks? That's it. You must be tired. I'll tell Suam to guide you. Meow. Mission completed. So now I'll go to the temple and borrow a book. Oh. Swimming into the wall. Hello. Human, what brings you here? The owner of the seed shop told me to borrow a book. The title was very long, I forgot it. I understand. Kajin always reads strange books. Niyama, I was told you would know which one as it was previously borrowed. If it's a book that Kajin borrowed, it might be one of these three. Pictures of the divine tree and its fruit on the cover. So maybe it's this one. Pictures of beautiful sensuous looking sea woman on the cover. Is it this? There are pictures of zombie-like sea people and the king fighting on the cover. It looks fun. Um, I mean, he probably wants the... How about take it with you? Come by any time. Let me guess. Every one of them is going to be wrong, but I'm going to be going back and forward. Every time. Riding on my little friend. Meow. Want to see some real speed? That's all I needed. Thanks, buddy. Bye. Let's see. Did I get it right? There are no customers today. There's a seaweed collector named Sushi. The collector provided seaweed. Hasn't been coming by. Is there a way to contact them? I have the key to the house, but I can't leave the restaurant. Sushi has a large pet turtle. I used to feed it from time to time. Go for me. It's hard to explain. The terrain keeps changing. That turtle eats so many jellyfish. Maybe there are traces. Find the seaweed collector. Okay. I don't want to do too many side quests. I want to kind of like push on now because I would like to finish this game. I think that would be fun to have a full playthrough, but we'll see how we go. This book. This is it. I mean, what am I saying? What are you thinking, bringing me a book like this? Uh, I heard it's something you borrowed before. No, well, what's this? <laughs> Some kind of misunderstanding? Uh, go look again. Dude. I'm not running to and fro to the temple and bringing all these books back for you to be silly about it. I got stuff to do, son. Important things. Okay. Crops are grown come harvest. Oh, did I hit sushi or farm? Don't think it took there. Nope. Will take my time to feed the cat there. Hello, sweetheart. There you go. Good girl. To the farm. Crops have grown. Let me pull these out. These were wheat, I think. All right there, Mr. Frodo. Pulling up your weeds there. 
arrow. Harvest complete. Can I, like, plant more? Wheat in the field. Wheat in the field. Planting wheat. Why can't I plant the wheat? Don't remember how to plant the wheat. Why? Why, is, why can't I not plant stuff? Does it just grow automatically in there? No, that's the rice field, right? Okay, so those seeds are for when I expand here. All right, I'll just hold on to them. It's fine. Boat. Better catch some sushi for tonight. Even though we have a bit, but we'll jump in and do some. Let me um, hit some upgrades. I've got some pretty good money. More air would be all of my money or more cargo. Okay, I thought I had a bit of money, but actually my upgrades are really expensive at this point. So maybe we just hold off for now. Dive in. So we're growing eggplant and carrot. Collect five kelp. Is our current mission for the day. Uh, Spaloosh. Let's go catch some fish. Mm, I don't know if I want the baseball bat. Let me catch some of these. Oh, swing and a miss. <gasps> this big boy parrot. I like that one. Not quite upgraded enough, is it? Oh. Wait, I can use the sub to get you. Well, I'll cut this one up. Maybe we'll use that on a different one. I forgot I got that. What are these? Triggerfish. Titan triggerfish. <clears throat> and these. Oh. Trevely. I have been collecting those quite a bit, I think. Gotcha. Ah, uh, tap, 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 tap. Reminds me of those old, like, Olympic games. Sort of running games, or like Sonic Olympics or Mario Olympics, where you have to like, A, B, A, B, A, B, A, B, to run and like, spam it. It's the funniest thing, playing that multiplayer when you're a kid, like, with friends. Like, you're literally just both sat there going, ah! <laughs> ah, kelp, nice. remember what the festival is that's coming up, what I need to collect. Um, I wonder how I check that. There's like a festival in a day. Ooh, you lucky. Shri Barracuda. Good night. Wow, you took so much for a mackerel. My oxygen lasts so long now that I don't even look at it. It's crazy. Squids. If I can, uh, if the upgrade gets some, it does get some hole. 
Oh, another Barracuda. Oh, I keep accidentally opening the Steam profile thing. Because it's like I'm shifting to run and then I hit tab to change my weapon. <gasps> Little sore mouth. Got him. Um, let's call it in. Save me carrying it. So I really think that submarine's supposed to be used when you use the hush gun and put them to sleep because I've already damaged the corpse there, so it's like I may as well just cut it up, but It is what it is. Let's see what weapon we get. A net. fish taken up. Bum, bum, bum. I guess if I'm full, I'll just go up, honestly. Escape pod arriving. Beep, beep, boop, boop. Sushi time? Sushi time. Oh. Oh, you got it. I input this here. Uh, I got some eco points. This has nothing to do with the lure. Don't be disappointed yet. Lure capsule. Oh. Drop this lure and lure all plankton in the area. Hi. Oh, this must be the lure for the manta race. Oh, my mouth is watering. Oh, I'm kidding. Anyways, oh, I need to be prepared to take pictures at night. I'll call you when I'm ready. Okay. Hmm. hmm. Sushi. Now. Hmm. Oh yeah, fish farm. What? What is happening? Oh, a strong earthquake. Earthquakes are becoming more frequent. Oh, I should check if sushi's alright. My gosh. That was scary. Oh, I felt a big earthquake. Is your place okay? It took some measures against earthquakes after it crumbled last time. I'm not sure for how long it'll withstand a series of earthquakes. Oh, is everyone okay? Dr. Bacon. Oh, I was passing by. I wanted to make sure you were all right. Hey, it looks like everyone's okay. Uh, Dave, what about sea people business? Any problems? The heat of the, from the ground is melting the ice. Many sea people got sick. Identifying the cause, I need to go to the glacial area. There's eerie monsters down there and I don't feel safe. Oh, it sounds like trouble, Dave. According to ancient records, sea people are susceptible to temperature change. Now you should go down to the glacial area ASAP. Find out what's happening. It'd be honourable to sacrifice yourself for the sea people, even if it means getting frozen. Excuse me? Never mind, uh, we can worry about that tomorrow. Today we feast. Okie dokie. Research. Let's see, hermit crab. Queen suit, bluefin tuna. Well, I know what a tuna looks like, so I can research that. And collect some yellowfin tuna, puffer special sea grapes. Trout sea grapes, boiled mantis. Small spotted dark kajimi. Uh, soybean paste roast. I don't think I need more stuff yet. Oh, also we're full, so. But I could level people up, right? 
Anyone need training? What does that do? Your cooking goes up. Maybe train my servers. I have two good chefs. She's very good. He could do with an upgrade. See if any unlock skills, though. Wait, you've got something here. Ingredient prep expert. So you're meant to be a chef, really. And I've got you serving. Hmm. Okay. I'm wondering if I should get rid of Masayashi Yoshi and... Wait, I can just swap you out, right? Yes, okay. So is there someone better for serving? Jandy with 47 for 300. And then if I swap you, you've got what? 40, so maybe I bring Yusuke in and just train them. So they can also do drinks. Would probably be a good idea. Wait, you're also a prep... Ugh, can they stop being chefs? What? Okay, hang on. Applicant list. Where's you? Let's see what skill you unlock. Swap for the new girl. Train. Tip master always gets tips. I mean, sure. What, what's your next thing? Seems to have prepared something. What have you prepared? A learned recipe. enough money on that. Menu. Uh, let's sell some specials, see if we can't up our um, taste, you know? For how we're getting those ratings. Ah, you get a different thing if you enhance a recipe. Because that's new. So I want to get a lot of bluefin tuna. I wonder if you can organize this. Yep. Perfect. This game has everything, dude. Like quality of life to be able to uh, arrange by taste. Perfect. I should just serve a load of this, really. Stick one of those on. what is my next star rating on cookstar don't i need more rank up i need more followers best taste and researched recipes okay let's do it what's this event one day till something wait Oh, they were already serving you. Okie dokie. Who wants this? And another one. Coming right up. Refill the wasabi. I'm coming, sir, as fast as I can. Oh, clean up. Perfect. One for you. Oh, it's looking like it's a good night. Tables to clean. Let the servers do their thing. I'm not 
getting too overwhelmed yet. Oh, you would take that one and I gotta run all this way, huh? Cool, cleared the menu out. Sweet, perfect. Actually perfect timing. That's gotta be one of the best days so far, isn't it? What we were serving to. Oh my god, eight grand. Crazy. What are you up to? <laughs> the wind is always cool and nice at night. I'm sobering up now. The radar of the sea people detected something. It's not from the water. receiving signals from the cave. This cave doesn't look like it was naturally formed. Worth an investigation. Ah, I'm playing as Dr. Bacon? Okay, cool. This is different. What's this? Oh, what a surprise, a mural. It's quite different from the murals of the sea people. Let me examine. What? Picture of sea people and humans. The sea people arrived. Children of the humans and the sea people hanging out together. The sea people giving shining fruit to humans. The fruit that we know about from the thing. Letters on the mural. Ah. Unlock the door. So I gotta match the symbols. So the third one, what's in red, is that one. Okay. And <clears throat> door number two. Okay, first door. I'm wondering if this is in order or if it's just what's here, but the first door is like a that one. That's easy to remember. A tent, I'll call it. And then it's a ma image. Okay. Not a mirror image. A mirror image. <laughs> so the tent. And then a mirror. A murmur. Come on. Was it that one? That one. The door's open. Oh, it looks dark and creepy. A true archaeologist would never miss this kind of opportunity. Getting brave. Oh no. This place. I looked at the bones and torture devices. I must examine the mural. The humans collapsed after eating the fruit. They poisoned them. Humans hunted the sea people. What happened? That's what happened. Humans couldn't live in harmony with the sea people if we're not for small misunderstandings. Let's first bring the artifact. Sorry. It's very early and I haven't had my coffee. Sea people rebreather. Wow, this breathing apparatus. Uh, maybe a sea people device for humans. To breathe forever? That noise. Pirates. What? Who is that? Why is he here? Ah, oh, pirates. Oh, what are they doing here? Back to the boat. A chase. This is our turf. Give us whatever you have. Oh, they won't let go easily. 
cool. Escape pirates. I'm in control. That's neat. Actually looks really good. This game continues to impress. Whoa! Dodge it. Ah. Eh. Doesn't turn very fast. Fainted. I must take the breathing apparatus for further study. Thursday. That was a busy Wednesday. Okay. Chapter 5 The Frozen Passage. It's party day! Yacht tuna party! Okay, so get all the tuna today. Wonderful. Let's do it. Sea people for chapter five, the frozen passage. The doctor, I've got a frozen passage. Right. I need to zip my way up there, don't I? Shwell. Impressive. You didn't run away, human. I, Suan, will guide you personally. Stay close to me. This is the door. It's right next to where I was. Let me see. Where's the key we found? Good. Insert it here. Good to know, the key's not a fake. Uh, there's one thing you should know. You can go straight down using the middle path in the Glacier Passage, but it must have been blocked to stop the Gaddens from escaping. There should be a contraption that opens the door somewhere around there. I'm needed elsewhere. Just don't die. <laughs> Just don't die. That'd be a shame, wouldn't it? <laughs> Listen, buddy. Are you going to assess me? The way is blocked, just as Suan warned me. I should search the area for another route down. By the way, what's that huge mural back there? It must say something about the sea people. Back to Bacon. Saved. So, hey, what are the fish we have down here? Secret fishies in the glacial place. Can't quite get these ones, no? Loosen them up a bit. I don't want to completely ruin them. Peacock squid. Imagine being such a beautiful animal and they call you a peacock. 
I'll be like, dude, really? You could have called me anything. Go to new region. Puzzle. Oh, these contraptions are overwhelming. In video games, players touch this and that to try and find out how to operate them. opened that one and closed that one. If we come back here and hit this one again. It rotates further through. Now both of these are down. I can swim over top and touch this. Closes that. There is a little monster down there, isn't there? I wanted to trap them. All oh, this place is infested as well. I should hide behind the statues. should take a picture. Fail? Sorry. What? Oh, I forgot I should move these. Let's zoom out, shall we? Forgot that was a thing. Sorry, it's been a while. It's been a while. Puzzles. I'm in a room. It's like the crystal maze. Come out, come out, come out. Da 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 Oh, when I hit the divine tree fruit, a strong light came out. The Gadon's hate light. Maybe I can use it. Run away. Rotate me, darling. Um, what's this one do? Turn just that way, does it? This seems to be the right passage, but the door's frozen. Uh, the ice is not that thick. Maybe I can use the divine tree fruit. Ooh. 
one. If the door remains open on this side, I could go straight down. There must be something that opens the door. Now I can go down directly. And the picture? Oh, it's frozen. I need to find something that could be used to melt it. Melt the ice. Ow. to love again. What's this region? More puzzles. Similar contraptions. I guess it should work like last time. It's like both of those puzzles together. Okay. And then... I'm gonna need to get that... Uh, No! Munched. Game over. I can't think of anything scarier, to be quite honest with you. So we turn this one once. The only thing we can do at the start is go up there and hit that. there. Closes the other one. So I'm reckoning you can grab the ball. I'm wondering if we want the ball to get the ice or if we want to use the ball to blind the zombo. We need to hit that button, don't we? Ah, we can get up into... Hang on a second. Hang on a second. Hang on a second. That lets me up into there. Which isn't going to let me hit that button, so I need to... I need to hit this button and then go up there. Alright. Hit that. Grab that. Grab the, grab the, f oh my god. You guys didn't see that, okay? It's fine, shh, it's fine, it's fine. You saw nothing. I wish it would save here so I don't do this every time. The more you die, the more irritating something gets. Yes, okay, well done. I wonder how long, maybe I get the thing first. Yeah. Let me get away from you. Ah. It can be hit multiple times. <laughs> get blinded, fam. Mm 
zip. Close is that. No problemo. I'm guessing we take this. And we want to... Well, we don't want to drop it, do we? Take that melt stuff, right? Okay. Pop this in the hole. That big ice wall is kind of intimidating. Imagine if we saw something move behind it. melted. Oh. The light from the divine tree. Maybe I can melt the ice if I can change the angle of the mirror. There's always a mirror puzzle. Every adventure game. Ah, return to the boat and ask Cobra. Well, there you go. Passage. The passage is open. Ow. 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 Made me go all gobbledygook. Okay. Let's go see what we need then. How do I... Ah. Up. Of course. But of course, dear. If you could be a mermaid, would you want to be one? Would you give up your life? You're at the beach one day. A gorgeous mermaid pulls up. Hi. Did you know your ancestors were mer? Let me unlock your secrets. Come, come, come. But you'll have to give up your human life and you can never return. Come and live with the sea people. Would you do it? Like, nah, I'm gonna be a human. I wouldn't do it just because I like my land life. It's, and, I, and I hate the water, so I have no reason to. <laughs> Thinking about it, there's very few pros in that situation for me personally. Oh, you want to take out the rock stuck in a crack? You should use a crowbar. Do you have one? Ah, oh, I ordered one, but the delivery ship carrying it sunk. You may find it on the sea floor where I found the giant squid. That'll be easy. I don't remember where that is, but I'll try. <laughs> Down we go. So we do a dive, and also we want to... Um, let me check the farm, actually. Is my vegetables done? Get tuna. Get the crowbar. Crowbar and tuna. Are these ready? Oh, they need watering. Of course. I forgot about that. Dee -dee 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 -dee. Oh, right there. What are you doing? Just doing some farming, are you? You're eating. How do you all do? Be seeing you then, boy boy. Okay, let's jump in. Try and remember where that was. 
I have a map. This is the thing with coming back to games like this. It's like, okay, you're saying that, but I don't remember where it is. There's Tuna. I don't have a map, huh? Damn it. Tuna. Man, everything's looking so crazy bountiful down here right now. I'm getting wrecked. What the best way to catch these is? I probably need like a net or something, honestly. gonna take I don't even know if I'm hitting the same one every time I'll go back up if I get a dart done or something Stingray. There's a hush gun. Oh my god, you're taking so much to kill. Did just see some oxygen here, didn't I? for me. Go to sleep. I think he had a big shark as well. Bloody hell. Nap. Nap time. Down to sleep. Six darts in tune, you're still awake. Oh, stupid fish. <sighs> well, it's party time, and I did not get the tuna. So I'm ready to take pictures of manta rays. Oh, I hired some lighting guys and I made them set up lighting fixtures. Oh, you must have spent some money. Can't pass up an opportunity like this. They told me that lighting fixtures were at a depth of 20 meters. Oh, I expect awesome pictures. Not on a, an event day, sir. Hey Dave, the crops you planted a couple of days ago are ready to be harvested. They grow so fast. All kinds of unexpected things happen at the Blue Hole. We need to prepare the ingredients. Or eat a farm. Weather's incredible. Crops are growing so well. Go harvest them yourself. Carrots. 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 Eggplant. 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 Visit often and show your love and the plants are plain clean. Okay, I guess I'll plant the wheat seeds that I bought from you. <laughs> and I guess get some garlic. I wonder if I should expand the rice paddy. Think about it. Oh, it's only one seed. Garlic, can I? There we go. 
Christ, it's not ready. Sushi. Menu. So any tuna that I have is going to be what we want to put on, I suppose. So we've got the blue fish tuna. Very tasty. I've got this dish of tuna as well. And this one. Okay, maybe we're actually okay. Anything else tunery? I'll serve these then. Since it's a festival and that's what they'll be ordering mostly, I'll just then have something I have a bunch of on there. Yeah? Let's do it. Open sesame. Eat, drink, love. So 20% is foam. Ugh. Oh dear. Uh oh. We're getting a little overwhelmed. the other end. Clear the table. Quick fam, quick. Stop doing beers and get that food. Nailed it. Not so much. That has to be our most successful day so far, surely. That's going to be big money. Oh, only 5k, and that other one was like 8k. That's crazy. Farming report available. It's a new day, and it's D-Day for Veggie Boy. Okay. Got quite a bit of money. Maybe I should upgrade now. Air tank. I don't know if I run out, really. Depth. Think we're okay. We might not be soon. Cargo, maybe. Maybe I need to do guns more. Certainly running into that issue. Yeah. I want to grab more, so let's do that. I guess air tank is also your HP. Keeps you alive. I have died a couple of times. Hmm. cargo and then we'll save up a bit more so we need to go where the delivery ship sank let's go take a look It's like down. It's like not too far. 
It's where we got the waifu thing. Not sure if it's down this way or if it's like up and around. Oh, not you again. This shark is a menace. What the heck? Like, can I live? Guess I will spend the money on that extra health. Well, it's gonna help too much. The thing hits hard. <laughs> I'm surprised it doesn't give me a waypoint, really. Okay, I got some O2. Cat food. Always welcome. Boink! Should be able to get stuff with my new harpoon, right? Let's have this undamaged. Do you mind? Well, that's a miss. Can you please? Let me live, man. Use the O2. Away from me. Oh, sorry, I meant to harp <laughs> A bit mean of me. Golf club. I'll just have to uh, avoid that fish for now. Now, I don't think the delivery thing was too far down, so... A dusky grouper. I think I've probably gone, like, the wrong way. It feels like this is getting to the depths, doesn't it? 80 meters. Towards the limestone cave, so I think I've missed it. I feel like it's really like to the left. I feel like it's where I was going on that last run before I died. The hush start. Sword. Yep. See anything here? Damn. No, this is going too deep. Yoink. Get got my little seahorse. Alright, and 
this is the end. Okay, so I want to go back all the way to the left. So we're pretty much at the stop here. Is that thing? That does less damage. It's a cheap one. Do you mind? It's one of those parrot heads, but even more aggressive. Good, that tip. If I was at... Whoa! Catfish. If I was a delivery truck, where would I be? See, now they would be great if you had a net, wouldn't they? for catching 300 fish. I'm going to get munched here. Oh my god. Piranhas. Dude, I'm so confused as to where this delivery thing is. I could have sworn it was just around there, no? Let me have a quick look, see if there's a map. Dave the Diver delivery boat location. Uh, dive straight down as soon as you enter the water, reach 100 meters depth. Ah, so it's lower. It's act it actually is down here? <gasps> Spikes! Oh, spikies! Get off me. It's worth just checking that. Well, that killed him. Just give that one little chop for fun, you know. It is here, okay. I so I, I knew it was. Straight away, I just didn't know it was that deep. It ain't that deep, fam. Good thing I googled. Let's go get that crowbar. Grab some fish on the way, doesn't hurt. Now what shark is that? Because we've been running into problems. Hammerhead. Whoa, he do be swinging. The hammer. Whoa. R.I.P. Missed. I don't see the crowbar anywhere here. Hmm. There it 
There it is. It's buried under rocks. Excalibur. Crabs, they're kind of cute. Have I aggravated a colony of crabs? They look ferocious. I'll deal with them to pick up the crowbar. I deal with the crap. Nothing's doing any. Oh, wait, I gotta drop rocks on them. I just remembered how we deal with crabs. Yep. Feels bad. But needs must. Oh, well, that didn't. Hey! Need health. I must get the crowbar. Oh, please, man. This ain't right. Be quick about it, Dave. Got a lot of fish in your pocket. Does it look familiar? I don't know. Let me get to the boat. Please don't die down there, Dave. Come on, mate. Drop something. Drop something. So we can swim a little bit faster. Nope, still too heavy. Drop one of the trevelies. I don't know if there was oxygen here. Yo, man, please. Not like this. Not like this. I'm a hundred down. I don't think I make it out. Pray for oxygen. No, no, not now, not now, not now, not now. Not like that. Ah, oh, an escape! Perfect. Oh, that's the one I ordered. You take this to the rock, insert it between the cracks, and pull it hard like this. You'll be able to take out that rock. Since you're here, check your gear. Don't forget, stop by sushi. Okay. Uses ingredient, keep an inventory. Captured seahorses. Oh, that's racing seahorse. You can use them as ingredient or keep them to take to the people. I'll just use them in ingredients, it's fine. Not really doing the racing, are we? Alright, sushi time. Do the sushi, because we've got a VIP coming. Cook what he wanted. Hey, you ready? Right on time. Have a seat. Dish. 
service. One vegetable sushi. Yeah, this is it. The taste of this vegetable sushi reminds me of my younger days. Your vegetable sushi is perfect. What's the secret? All I did is seasoning properly. I got some help from my acquaintances for the ingredients. Uh. <laughs> All right, son. Dad. I wondered who'd eat something like vegetable sushi. I didn't know it was you. I heard people talking, someone looks like you. That's why I visited here and ordered vegetable sushi. It's been eight years since you left home. You've never contacted us ever since. Uh -huh. right, it's a long story. <laughs> it's a long story. We're sorry about how you got your voice and don't sound nothing like me. There is a store when I got shipwrecked on an uninhabited island. Hmm. There were just trees and the sea. I worked hard to get food and water. I sometimes hunted wild animals with a harpoon gun and roasted them. I had to spend some years on the island until I got rescued and settled here. Yo, what a story, Dad. I wanted to visit home after securing a stable life here. But it took so long and time flew. I'm sorry, my boy. The folks at the village think you abandoned us, Dad. My friends pitied me. Some mocked me. I began writing music and singing songs to relieve stress and become a rapper. My son's grown into a fine young man. Even without me, I'm proud of you, son. I blamed you so much at first, but the music healed me. Give me inner peace. Since you come all the way here, why don't you stay at my farm? Oh yeah, like old times. <laughs> Since you're all grown up, we can grab a beer together. Well, daddy issues solved quickly and easily. They have something in common, both quite talkative. Dude must have much to say. Alright, and we got a vinyl record. Deliver the food to MC Sammy. He's gonna put it in some jammies. Eat them in his jammies. Sushi in your jammies. PJs and sushi. <laughs> now I just want to eat sushi in my PJs. Mm. Let's load up the menu with our vegetable sushi. And let's, yeah, let's just order by taste and keep doing tasty, tasty things. I feel like serving all of the best tasting stuff is probably the best way to rank up your thing. I think to level up, I need to actually make something taste really good. So I need to level, level up whatever I have a bunch of a ton. Coral porridge. Another sick person. Oh, I forgot about that. Here you go. Furious chopping. Furious tasting. Furious boxing. There you go. Alright, open. Skip it about that, but. Let's have a good service, everyone. Good luck, good luck, good luck. Fast, fast, fast. Yes, chef. Wasabi. Oh no, I picked it up by accident. Oh no, you're not gonna run all that way. I wish I could hand it off. Uh, uh. Any other wasabs? Wasabi hero, run. Got it. Just in time. Clear the plate. Oh, didn't mean to that. Someone get that drink. I think I'm overfilling my menu.
there's still nine of 15 or something left. They didn't order that at all, but they cleared everything else out. Uh, 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 uh. 4K. How the hell did I do that 8K day? I don't even know what I had serving there. Probably like full meals, I guess. Make more recipes. Yes. Gal Gal? A new greeting sound? It's from a new game I'm playing these days. What game are you playing? It's Gal. A game raising digital fish. You feed them and keep them happy. They grow and mutate. Sounds somewhat familiar. What's better is, it's linked with Marinka. You get a grown up fish, you can unlock a Marinka. Awesome. Try it yourself. Okay, just a new game. A little mini game. Yow, a digital fish that keeps you company in your mobile phone. Okay, it's kind of cute. Hello, Dave. Have a good night's sleep. Uh, did you spend enough time talking with Sammy? <laughs> of course. We've not seen each other so long before yesterday. We had a good time. By the way, I want to show you something. Come to far. This guy's always get dragging me to his farm. Tell me on the phone. <gasps> Chickens. Okay, this was worth me bringing, bringing me here. Chickens? Sammy, what happened to your clothes? Shut out. Hey, yo, I talked to my pops yesterday and I got all sentimental, you know what I'm saying? I became a rapper because I love music, but I got tired of that celeb life. I think we could use them to cook with. I'll give them to you when we get here. Take them to the cook. You quit music? No, no, I'll stay here and enjoy my rural life and nature while writing new songs here. You know I can release new songs at any time online these days. It's easy. Oh, well, what's up with that chicken? I shared some food with neighbors and they gave me this chicken in return. I wanted to make a yummy fried chicken, but my son wanted to lay eggs. He made a chicken for him overnight. He reminds me of my younger self. Yeah, I got inspiration from the rhythm of the hammer. Warms my heart to see you and your son together. Speaking of the chicken, from now on I'll offer you eggs. Eggs? I can't give you more than one egg because there's only one chicken on farm. If you want more chickens, are Sammy. If you remember, one, only one egg per chicken a day. Yeah. There are two grades for eggs, grade A and B. Good grade chicken lay good grade eggs. Yeah. I'll stay here with my pops. Eggs. Raise some chickens. Nutritious. Rice and eggs. Collect them. What do you want to talk to me about? <laughs> ah, it's new stuff in the shop. Expand field. You can buy eggs too. Nice. Let's get a free range chicken. More eggs. I bet eggs are going to be good for ingredients for stuff. Let's get a bunch of carrots. Fill up my watering can. Plant said carrots. go. Not pennies bought. So now if I go to Glacier, time to upgrade your equipment. My guy, I cannot afford that. Can I? Mm -hmm. 
so how do I, I go up here and then to the right, I think. There it is. Making my way downtown through a frozen passage and I'm deep bound. Get it. find the leverage for it. Oh. Zoom. Melt, 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 melt. Climate change, climate change. Amazing. It just melts the thick ice wall. I could kill for a hot bowl of miso soup. Whoa, what's that? You're a cheeky little thing, aren't you? This is a dead end. Oh, almost, almost there. I should check the surroundings. Okay, but first this dude. Oof, pelican eel. That was terrifying. Whoa. Oh, I'm at a critical depth. I need to... Yeah. <laughs> Defrost. Oh my god, that's so good. Look at that. You have to wipe the lens. That's such a touch, dude. That's so cool. Do you want me to zoom all the way out? So I'm at crit depth, so I do need to upgrade my depth, I think, to go beyond this. I need to do another upgrade. As I suspected. Let's hit this next puzzle first. Ice walls blocking the way. Ah, mirror puzzle. Okay. So we need to open that up. Pop this in. Really hurt. Oh, ah, uh, <laughs> no! <laughs> I didn't realize. Oh my god, choking! I didn't realize that that's gonna hurt so much. Oh, what would be better, the eel or the skin? I oh, know. Bloody hell! I have to be careful with rotating those, aren't I? Whilst I'm here, see if I can upgrade my... Nope! Oh wait, no, I can. There you go. Great. Let's try that again. Three days till a swordfish event, by the looks of things. Honestly, the fact that I served so much tuna and we didn't make that much money, I don't know if I really... I'm going to focus on the festivals too much. It didn't increase it by very much. To be honest. Alright, give it another 
the go. Okay. Down. Down again. Avoid the eel. Line these up first before I do anything. So I want that to be pointing up there, I would believe. Mm, which way is it going to do it? Probably the right way. Top right. Not that. I don't know. Some oxygen. Okay, so you want to melt that wall, so this is going to have to be pointing this way. What? I don't understand. It's like, why can't it point towards it? I need to move that. Ah, maybe when this comes up, it'll be a thing. But how do I move those? I don't have a button yet, so the first thing is probably... ...to reflect this. Somehow. So, let's just, let's give it a go. I'll just avoid the beams a bit better this time. Hopefully. And a button before I can get in there. It looks like that's just for a bonus though, so not actually super necessary. Oh, okay, so it's got nothing to do with the mirrors. <laughs> How are you expecting me to get through this now? me, like, analysing it like I'm Oppenheimer here, working out how the bloody hell to do the thing, and it just points a different direction. Meow. Just try to scare you, I promise. More pictures. Frost. Squeak. We're listening to 10 hours of glass cleaning ASMR. <laughs> oh, still some frost on there, is there? they're going to go in really after what happened last time. If they don't hit me, I'm good with it. Okay, not quite that one. Action. Action. 
Who knew I was going to be good at mirror stuff, huh? Like I want to turn that off now. Don't want to get fried. What's the hardest puzzle game you've ever played? I feel like puzzle games walk a really fine edge, because if it's too hard, like, no one wants to play you, you know? Oh man, I gotta, like, send the... thing through here, huh? Send the beam to the other room. Tate does. Feeling like it's going to be this, to be honest, but let's see. Sorry, this is the other room. I thought I, was, I thought I was already in the other room and that was another one. Imagine. It's like, not again. Place is too dark. I hit this fruit and it glowed. Oh, but I feel like there's going to be something not nice in here. that thing? The god on's humongous. It's chained. Let me escape this place. Wow. A chained up Gadon. It's got to turn out to be somebody, surely. Oh my god, is it going to break through? That thing should be able to escape since it's so big. We have to get out of this current. Giant Gadon. No way. Oh, we're going to die if we get caught. Oh. 
one was going to get me. Oh, look out, Dave. Dave! Oh, God. Oh, keep going. <gasps> Ooh, it's really difficult. Oh, shoot. That was a bit hairy. Something doesn't seem right. It's preparing an attack. The Divine Tree. Get it. Oh. I'm sorry. You can't just introduce new mechanics for hitting things. Just make it a left click. How am I supposed to know that means move your mouse? Game. Come on, you've let me down there. There we go. Introduce the mechanic before. It wasn't even my mouse that to use WASD. Who does that? Dun, 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 dun. Oh, a dead end. There's no way out. Oh my god, it'd be so scary. I think it fainted. The path opened. Let's run away. No way. What a disgusting creature. Get Catherine vibes being chased by that thing. that vibration. <laughs> I should let my guard go. Dave, it's just going to wake up and chase you again. Flappy bird. Too good. Oh, I'll able to escape. I'll be able to escape that way. <gasps> Quick time event. Barricade the entrance. Pull it. Oh. Suam? did something and saved my life. <laughs> Humans are not that trustworthy. 
You would have already been eaten by the deep sea fish, right? Not there for you. I admit it this time. Thank you, Suwon. Go find out what's happening in the glacial area as you promised me. I didn't imagine this place would be this cold. I'll freeze to death if I go further. Help this human. You don't have any gear or clothes to protect your body from the cold. I'll return to Cobra. Let's return to the village. See that huge mirror? Activate it again. You'll be whisked to the village. Pull the right lever. I'll pull the left one. Oh no. Suarm. What are you doing? Grab the lever on the right, human. You're a bit close to the hand, dude. I've seen enough movies to know what happens next. All right, pull these levers on my signal. Good, now we can access this place straight from the village. Go back to the village and find a way to withstand the cold. Humans, so fragile. Something unthinkable for a super war superior warrior like me. Your tail's been shaking for some time now. Are you all right? <laughs> what are you talking about? You're mistaken. Let's return to the village. <gasps> Achoo! Oh, I guess Krill went up my nose. What? Why are you sneezing? You came. How was the glacial area? There was a huge gadon in the passage. It's too cold, I need something. You're equipped to explore the area for sure with your light diving suit. Our people wear clothes with divine tree fruits and can withstand the cold. I'm curious, can you tailor the divine tree fruit cloths? Tailoring? Cobra or Dr. Bacon may know. You have talented friends, take this cloth. Nice. Chapter 6 The Melting Glacier. Dave, is everything going well? I opened passage to the glacial area, but I can't explore the area because it's too cold. Your current suit's not warm enough, I see. The sea people gave me this cloth, but I don't know how to use it. The cloth's warm to the touch. This is breathing apparatus I found. I can make a cold resistant suit if I have a mechanical part. Mechanical part? Don't you have one from John Watson's suit? You're right. I bought some complex mechanical parts. Ah, this is a device that automatically adjusts water pressure. But it's too damaged. I've got a good idea. What is it? I'll tell you later in the evening. I have a bad feeling about this. Thank you for watching Dave the Diver part whatever this is. We're getting quite close to the end, so um, please do hit that like and let me know in a comment if you'd be interested in seeing that. I know it's been quite some time since I played it last, so we'll see how this one does. But thank you for watching. I appreciate you. Go check out one of those videos there on the screen for some more with me, and I'll see you next time. Good night.